Hey guys, welcome back to Skyrim and more nonsense. Today we're going to be going back to the Thieves Guild and finishing it up, hopefully. And I'm already getting like 10 million people going, Hey, you're the Harbinger of the Companions. Hey, you're the guy that saved the world with Oriole's bow. Hey, you're the Grandmaster Thieves Guild that killed the freaking Emperor. It's going crazy. Oh my god. I've done so many things. Um... Where's the upstairs? Well, we are going to be reporting back to Maven Blackbriar first of all, as we did finish the. Me, so get out of my face! Wow, everyone in this town is rude. I'm gonna have to I fix that. You have good news for me? Yeah, job's finished. This doesn't tell me much. The only thing that could identify Sabion's partner is this odd little symbol. Yeah, I've seen that symbol before, actually. Well. Whoever this mysterious marking represents, they'll regret starting a war with me. You should bring this information to the Thieves' Guild immediately. There's also the matter of your payment. I believe you'll find this more than adequate for your services. Sweet. I believe we're done. How much did I get from her, actually? Is it gonna give a, me a gold total? guess not. I guess I just have to assume that she paid me. And as stupid as this looks, I'm actually going to equip it like that. It's the best benefit for me. I think the other hood is sneak increase, and I've got so much sneak it's ridiculous. But I need that extra bow damage. That's Please pretty much all I do. I'm going to lose my job at the Ripton Fishery. Lizard. Sad, sad lizard. You ask me, those brats in the orphanage are better off now that old Grelard is dead. Do 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 do. Push this button. I'm glad we got this unlocked at least. It makes getting down to the Thieves Guild a lot easier. If I can just go in through the back door. Hello. Come here a second. Huh? What? You said that? What's up? A lot of people are beginning to get impressed with you here. Me included. Just wanted to let you know. Oh. Uh, thanks, I guess. Can you train bitter I'll at archery? You I know. Ugh. You're expensive. Come find me if you need more marksman training. Hi, Serena. I'm just having a sit. That's fine. Okay, let's check some stuff out back here. Do 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 Hi, Bren. Word on the street is that poor Sabjorn has found himself in White Run's prison. How unfortunate for him. Yeah, it's a tragedy. Exactly. Now you're beginning to see how our little system works. Maven sent word that you discovered something else while you were out there. Something important to the guild? Some symbol from Golden Glow was involved. Then this is beyond coincidence. First Arangoth, and now Sabjorn. Mm. Someone's trying to take us down by driving a wedge between Maven and the guild. Is there anything we can do about it? Mercer thinks he knows a way to identify this new thorn in our side. He wants to meet with you right away. And if I were you, I'd hurry. I've never seen him this angry before. Alright. Should probably remove that quest marker at some point. I've gotten really lazy. Hello. Ah, there you are. I've consulted my contacts regarding the information you recovered from Golden Glow Estate, but no one can identify that symbol. I found the same marking in Haunting Brew Metery. It would seem our adversary is attempting to take us apart indirectly by angering Maven Blackbriar. Very clever. Um, uh, well maybe we can actually recruit them. You jest, but they've been able to avoid identification for years. They're obviously well-funded, driven, and patient. Just don't mistake my admiration for complacency. Our nemesis is going to pay dearly. Hmm. Okay, so what can we do about all this? Because even after all their posturing and planning, 
they've made a mistake. The parchment you recovered mentions a Gajal lie. According to my sources, that's an old alias used by one of our contacts. His oh, real name up. is Gollum I. That's not a very good nickname. It sounds almost exactly like his real name. Uh, where do you want me to start? Golomai is our inside man at the East Empire Company in Solitude. I'm betting he acted as a go-between for the sale of Golden Glow Estate and that he can finger our buyer. Get out there, shake him down, see what you come up with. Talk to Brynjolf before you leave if you have any questions. I guess I'll go back and talk to Brynjolf really quick. Probably won't hurt anything. Shadow marks. Let's just look around. Nah. My book reading add-on apparently got an update. Now it'll just glow regardless if I haven't read something, not just skill books. I don't remember when I installed that, but it's been kind of handy, so. I can't believe Gollum is mixed up in all this. That Argonian couldn't find his tail with both hands. Don't get me wrong. He could scam a beggar out of his last septum, but he's no mastermind. You think he'll give me any trouble? Trouble? Huh. He's one of the most stubborn lizards I've ever met. You have your work cut out for you. So how do I get him to talk? You're going to have to buy him off. It's the only way to get his attention. If that fails, follow him and see what he's up to. If I know Gullamai, he's in way over his head, and you'll be able to use it as leverage. Okay. Well, um, betrayal or not, I guess I have to left let him live, because that's the way you people do things. I'm glad to see you're embracing our methods. It would be a waste to lose a contact at the East Empire Company before we had the entire story. Just keep on Gollumai's tail, and he's bound to step into something he can't scrape off his boot. Hmm. Uh, who is the East Empire Company? I just wondered this. A mercantile group that has established ports all over Tamriel. They pretty much dominate the whole shipping industry. The Emperor himself supposedly backs them, which means they have fairly unlimited resources. So don't get their feathers in a ruffle. Okay. Good luck in solitude. Keep Golomai alive, but remind him who we are. Oh, what the heck's this? Use their resource at my disposal. I can't find a trace of your parents. Oh dear. What did you need? That sounds sad. Poor Rune. I wonder if that's a side quest, actually. What the hell? Open that! Don't shut the door on me. Anyway, let's head on over to Solitude and meet up with this guy at the East Empire Trading Company. Hello! So, what do we have here? Hmm, let me guess. By your scent, I'd say you were from the guild. But that can't be true, because I told Mercer I wouldn't deal with them anymore. Oh. Well, this guy's a bunch of pickles and beets. I'm here about the Golden Glow Estate. I don't deal in land or property. Now, if you're looking for goods, you've come to the right person. You can drop the act now. Oh, wait. Did you say Golden Glow Estate? Uh, my apologies. I'm sorry to say I know very little about that uh, bee farm, was it? You acted as a broker for its new owner. Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. I can't be expected to remember every deal I handle. <sighs> Let's see if we can persuade him. I don't care what you promise. If I tell you the buyer's name and word gets around, it can ruin me. Oh dear. Uh, well, what would it actually... No. Hmm. Intimidate check. Hasn't Mercer Frey taught you people anything? Wow. You kill me, and your only contact with the East Empire Company vanishes. That's not smart for well, business. Well, damn it. I guess we have to buy him off. Well, now that you mention it, there is something I've been trying to get my hands on. 
I have a buyer looking for a case of Firebrand wine that just so happens to be a single case in the Blue Palace. Bring it to me, and we'll talk about Golden Glow Estate. <sighs> okay, fine.